Hey guys, so I'm going to be doing a short vlog today. Um, it depends on how short it's going to be by like what I do today. Because I'm supposed to be going to my cousin Aiden's birthday party at Pump It Up. If you don't know what Pump It Up is, it's basically this place that has like those blow up bouncy things. But it's like huge and they're way much cooler than those like circus bounce toy things you just jump in. They have slides and obstacle courses and stuff like that. So we're going to do that and I'm trying to figure out like what I'm going to wear. Anyway, and then tomorrow I might be getting my hair on braid because I've been wanting to do it for about a year. And then uh, my mom has to go to this Christmas party Thursday with my dad for his work. So we're going to get our hair done tomorrow at JCPenney's. Hey guys, so I'm finished getting ready. Um, but I still need to clean up my room because whenever I try to find an outfit, I always end up with a huge mess like this. And it's not as big as it normally is. Not as big as it normally is. So I decided on not the Wookiee shirt. I decided on the Paris shirt. Because I just think it's a little more floppy and easier to like, I don't know, move around in since there's going to be like a lot of kids. So yeah. Excuse the weird lighting. I didn't know how else to like make it brighter so you can actually see my face but yeah so I decided to put my hair up in a messy bun my hair is being difficult right now so it's kind of like a weird bun thing but we're gonna go with it I used to do so much with my makeup but now I'm just like slowly getting into the no makeup stage like a lot of times I'll wear no makeup and sometimes I'll just wear concealer and powder but I feel like that's kind of a good thing because a lot of people in our generation now feel pressured to always be wearing makeup and always make sure your face looks perfect and there's no imperfections. But really, I don't think it matters that much. I mean, I'm still like in the stage of where I really prefer putting some face makeup on before I go to like a store. But I try not to do that so often because I'm kind of like training myself. Sorry about like the weird camera angles, but I'm trying to do my laundry while I talk. But yeah. So, anyway. Um, but I challenge, if you're watching and if you wear makeup, I challenge you to go somewhere with no makeup. And if you do that, let me know. Because that's the next step to being more natural. Because, you know, it's good to be natural. You don't always have to be, you know, all makeup fied. I mean, I get that a lot of people like to wear makeup. If you like makeup, then fine. That's fine. But, like, I feel like people are so accustomed to, like, being the perfect model. And some of those models... They had double chins. They were just made that way. And you know what? They're photoshopped. So now I'm going to wait for my mom to be back. And this is like my stand I used to play my flute on. And that's my stand bag down there. But this is one of the books. Like, this is a book. These are music sheets. This is the book from uh, my sixth grade year, first year playing. And that was, not, I was in ninth grade. I'm in ninth grade, so. Nine, eight, seven, six. So it's been four years, and I had to take class at my co-op. If you don't know, I take um, like classes at this church because I do homeschooling now. I've been homeschooled since eighth grade, and this is my ninth year. So I've been two years of homeschooling, and my mom's here, so my dog is working. But anyway, so we go to classes at this church, and it's really fun. It's just like public school. You just go on Wednesdays every week. That's it. But yeah, anyway, my mom's here, so I will let you know when we get to pump it up or when we leave and stuff. So I will talk to you guys then. Hey guys, so I'm getting my hair done today. I decided that I didn't want to do like heat in my hair because I didn't want to damage it anymore. Or like, I don't know. I don't know, mess up a process. But anyway, so I just decided to put it in this like messy braid thing which I think it looks kind of cute but I'm one of those people that aren't like a fan of having my hair in my face so I'm constantly like moving this over because I feel like it's all up in my face and I don't like that which is kind of why I always have my hair up in a bun or in a ponytail because I really hate my hair in my face. It's 9 a.m. exactly and my appointment's at 10 so my mom's gonna be ready by hopefully 9 30 and we'll go. I haven't eaten breakfast yet and I'm kind of hungry and I feel like fruits I'm probably gonna get some. I got this shirt from where did I get this from? Oh wait I got this from Kato. Okay I fixed the blurriness. But anyway so that's the shirt and then the back is plain and it's long enough to cover my bum. Um but yeah shirts are usually longer on me because I'm not like six foot or like five I'm not even five five or five four. But yeah so that 
And then I have my fuzzy socks on. I'm going to wear these with my combat boots because they keep me warm. And I don't have, like, leg warmers just yet. I am wearing these earrings. They're, like, spikes. Like, I don't know, triangle spikes. But I got these from Charlotte Roos. Yeah, so I will vlog as much as I can. And I will see you guys when we're done. Hey, I heard you are a wild one. Ooh. So I got my hair done. And I didn't really vlog there because it literally took us four hours. Um, my mom got done like ten minutes before me and that's because the girl was curling my hair. But it's not as curled as it was before. I know a lot of people say it's bad to bleach your hair, but my hair literally does not feel dry. She was like um, talking to me and she, well, I was telling her what I wanted like done to cut it because I got some bangs. And yeah, I got some on the side and I got layers in the back, but... People are going to think I'm crazy, but if you want to know how much it was, like, ask, because I don't want to see it on camera, because it was quite a lot, but, um, now that they have, like, they have a thing where if you have, like, short hair, which is, like, right here, so, like, a little under your shoulders, it's $10 extra, but if you have hair all the way to your stomach, to your belly button, then you gotta pay $15, and I, yeah, I had to pay $15, I probably would have had to pay, like, 30 if they wanted past your waist or something. But I'm still super happy with it. They took extra care of my hair, so they did a lot of strengthening oils. You can kind of see it. Well,